So friends, today we are going to learn one important numerical from your chapter number seven. The question you can see is given, calculate the pH of the solution in which 0.2 molar NH4Cl and 0.1 molar ammonia NH3 are present. The PKV value is given 4.75 for the ammonia solution. So friends, this, step, this question is in actual from your textbook, but it is given in very short in your textbook. So here I am explaining you in detail how the calculations are to be done and how it is to be mathematically done. So first of all, I uh, suggest you this divided, this uh, numerical is divided into three different parts. In first part, friends, we have to find out the value of KB because PKB is given, KB is not given. So first thing is to find out the KB. Second part in which friends using the value of KB, we will find the value concentration of OH minus and H plus. And finally, in third step, we will find the pH of the solution. So let's start one by one. This is step number one in which friends, the PKB is given and as you know, PKB is equal to log of KB. This is the formula similar to pH formula. So PKB value is given friends 4.75. So this is, I put here and 4.75 is there. Now I want to find KB. So friends, excess things I have to remove. Excess thing is what? Minus and log both. I, we know that to remove the log, we have to use the anti-log. But first of all, the minus sign is there. And that's why if I multiply on both sides by minus, I get the value of this minus 4.75. And that is log KB. Now friends, KB is equal to anti-log of minus 4.75. Here, the one most important thing you have to keep in mind, and that is what the antilog of negative is not directly possible. And that's why we have to split this number by splitting this and 4.75 into minus 5 plus 0.25. This is nothing else but the splitting of this minus 4.75. Friends, you will get the answer. Uh, of addition minus 5 plus 0.25 is minus 4.75. Now friends, KB is equal to, we have to see the log, anti log of 0. Point, anti log of 0. 0.25 and this 10 is to minus 5. This minus 5 will go to the direct power and friends, if you use the anti log from your textbook, you will get the antelope of 0 0.25 is 1.778. So this is the first one. We get the value of KB by using the value of PKB. So this is the first half of the numerical we have done in which we find the value of KB. Now friends, we have to go for the next calculation in which we find the value of the NH, uh, NH, NH4 plus concentration and friends, the H plus and OH minus. So before we go for that, we have to put here the values. The NH4Cl is given. So NH4Cl, when ionized friends, it, constant, it will be ionized into NH4 plus and Cl minus. You can see the concentration of NH4Cl is given 0.2. So the concentration of NH4 plus and Cl minus will be equal because they are in equal mole number of moles. So this is the first one. Second thing is that friends, the concentration of ammonia is given 0.1. So concentration of ammonia 0.1 molar NH3 is given by using these two things. Now we have to go for the next thing in which friends 
we will find the concentration. So the reaction is NH3 when react with the water molecule H2O, we will obtain NH4 plus and OH minus. This is the reaction. In this reaction, if we find, if we write the initial concentration, so initial concentration is to be taken from this value and we will get what? It's 0 0.1 molar of ammonia. Water's concentration is not to be calculated because in value of Kb, the concentration of water is already included. This concentration is friends 0 0.2 and this is zero. This is all initial we are talking about. This is the effect, friends. This is the effect. 0 0.1 molar ammonia is there already. It is the concentration of ammonia initially, as well as in normal cases, initial concentration of products are zero, friends. But in this numerical, this is the most important term you have to keep in mind. That is the concentration of NH4 plus ion is initially is to be taken 0 0.2, which is normally to be taken 0. But here, as the NH4Cl is given, we have to put this value. Now, friends, at, at equilibrium, at equilibrium, what happened? So if we think that the X component of the NH4 plus and Cl minus OH minus are obtained. In that case, we have to write this is 0 0.2 plus X, and this is just X. Right, friends? So 0 0.2 plus X, and this is X. Here is 0 0.1 minus X. The X concentration, which is converted into product, is to be added here, and similar is to be subtracted here, friends. So this is one important thing. Now, last important next important thing here is to write the value of the kv so kv is equal to concentration of products upon concentration of reactants so concentration of products and reactants this is product these are products nh4 plus and here is oh minus divided by NH3. Once again, I tell you concentration of NH3, uh, sorry, concentration of H2O is to be neglected here, is not to be calculated here. Now, friends, by putting these values, 1, 2, and 3 values, add value of KB, we will obtain 1.778 into 10 raised to minus 5 is equal to concentration of, concentration of the NH4 plus is, you can see, 0 0.2 plus X. So we will obtain, this is 0 0.2 plus X and into concentration of F, OH minus, that is X. So here, X is to be taken another one. And concentration of ammonia, that is NH3, is in the denominator it is to be put friends 0 0.1 minus x it is from here so 0 0.1 minus x so this is what we obtain now friends value of x here the concept uh, kb is very small why kb is very small because it is 1.778 into 10 is to minus 5 so in both the cases the x value of x X is to be neglected. Value of X is to be neglected. So friends, 1.778 into 10 raised to minus 5 is equal to 0.2 X upon 0.1. This is what we obtain. This value into plus 2 plus X and minus X is to be neglected. So this is 0.2 by 0.1. 1.778 into 10 raised to minus 5 is equal to what 2x we obtain. Okay, friends. And now x is equal to 1.778 by 2 into 10 raised to minus 5. So value of x friends we obtain by calculating is 0 0.889 
into 10 raised to minus 5. So this is the value of pens. This is the value we obtain of pens x. Now, what is x? Look at here. x is OH minus. x is our OH minus. So we obtain the value of OH minus and OH minus is equal to 0 0.889 into 10 raised to minus 5. You know, friends, H plus into OH minus is 1 into 10 raised to minus 14. That is what? That is KW. Ionization constant of water is to be used here. Now, value of H plus is to be find. Value of OH minus is 0 0.889 into 10 is to minus 5, 1 into 10 is to minus 14. So H plus is equal to 1 into 10 is to minus 14, 0 0.889 into 10 is to minus 5. So this is friends H plus here. If you do the uh, division 1 upon 0 0.889, you will obtain the answer friends 1.12. And this is 10 is to minus 14 plus 5. So the concentration of H plus is 1.12 into 10 is to minus 9. This is water. So this is how the concentration of H plus is to be found. Now, the last and final answer, final step of this uh, numerical is to be find pH. It's, you know very well, log minus log of 10 base H plus, this is log 1.12 into 10 is to minus 9 friends, minus log of 10, 1.12. In log, always multiplication is to be converted into addition. So this is plus and minus log 10, 10 is to minus 9. This is 0 point, the log of 11 into 2. Log is to be seen of first four digits. So log of 11 into 2 is to be seen in log table and you will get the answer 0, 4, 9, 2. And this is, you will obtain 9 because minus 9 come forward and log 10, 10 is 1. So minus 1 into minus 9, that is 9. Then friends, this is 9 minus 0 0.049. You will get the answer 8.95. So this is the value of pH. Now, friends, also you have to keep in mind what the concept, uh, what is the pH we obtain? pH we obtain is 8.95, approximately 9 pH we obtain. And what is our substance? Our substance is ammonia, NH3, right? NH3 is a weak base and weak base has pH value in the range of 7.12 or 7.01 to 10. So this is normal one. So we are, our answer is nearby to the uh, standard values and that's why it is correct. Okay, friends, I think you got it. Thank you.